Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to the Atlantis 1957 Cadillac Eldorado Brome build. Last night we shot the body again with some a really heavy coat. I think it was, yeah, it was heavy coat. I think I went around the car twice, actually. And uh, as you can see on the top, it laid down pretty darn nice. If I can, I mean, there's there's a little bit of warble, but look at that compared to what it was. I mean, a little bit of orange peel, but for what it was looking like. Sorry, I'm kind of putting my face in the camera here. Make sure I got you in the view. The sides, as you can see there, a little bit of orange peel. Not near as bad as it was. But look at that trunk lid in that hood. From a spray can, I don't think I'm going to complain about it. Got a nice gloss to it, as you see my cub wing in the trunk lid there. But I think I'm going to let this thing sit. This is just overnight. I think I'm going to let it sit for cure for, I don't know, maybe a week or so. I don't know how long you got to wait until you do the bare metal foil and stuff. And I'm wondering if I'm going to do bare metal foil. I've seen a lot of people use the, I think it's called Alcad. Or all clad. I don't know. Some of the metal paints they got nowadays. I know it starts with an A. But they really uh, put a good finish on it. And I think for, like I said, the first card that I've done in um, at least 15 years, car model, I, I think I'm pretty happy with the way the paint went. I think in the future I'll probably airbrush and just get like a 2k clear or something like that and yeah it's time to get that airbrush out but I already bought the rattle can paint for it so I figured oh we'll see what happens and yeah now that we wet sanded it and gave it another coat I'm uh, I'm happy with it I think for a starter starter model um, I can't complain too much about it. And I was pretty bummed out there after the seeing how nasty the orange peel was the first time. I was like, oh, I ruined it. But it just goes to show, I mean, you can, you can sand them down and hit them again. I definitely learned that wet coats are better. Don't do the, the little mist coats. That's what I guess causes that orange peel, according to the Google. Um, but yeah, I'm going to let it cure for a while. This car, we've already, what, um, six months already, so what's another week or so? But I'd like to thank everyone for watching, and the next video, I could still work on the tires and get the chrome stuff going. We need to wash the grip, back of the grill out. Uh, to bring out the detail and all that so anyways like I said I'm happy with this paint and we're going to go from there and I'd like to thank everybody who's following along thank everyone who's been watching and we'll see you guys next time